Argentina in the finals. Is this the final game? No, this is the quarterfinals. There's eight teams left. We got 112 in the house. Let's go. Hi, Connie. Happy Friday. France is good. So is England, though. Never doubt the English soccer players. They can score their goals. They know how to. I'm Michelle. Yesterday was so productive, guys. Went shopping, went to the gym, made a post or two. Today's been total opposite. Just been so lazy. At least, uh, it's football. <laughs> it's football. It is football. I think of this football. And B, hello. Hi, Cammy. I like your hair. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. Thanks, Melody. Happy Friday. Are we all excited for the weekend? Any fun plans? Any cool things we're doing? Um, I actually kind of have a busy weekend. A little bit. Hi, Olza. Good morning, good morning. It's afternoon for me. It's 4 o'clock. It's 4.15. What's happening? I got family time tomorrow all day. And... Yeah, Sunday I have a shoot. Shoot. Thank you, Michelle. Thank you, thank you. That's a good song. This song? Jessica Simpson? I have that sound safe for so long. Hey, Ryan. Thank you, buddy. Thank you, thank you. Merci, Kami. Merci beaucoup. Mari with the gold mine. We were just about to say chill live. <laughs> we can't say it. We can't say it. Last time it was uh, it was cursed. Happy Friday, Olza. Thank you. The beanie's off today. Yeah, cause we're having a decent hair day today. So no beanie. The beanie only goes on when it's like out of control. Morning's chilling. Let's go. It's my kind of Friday. Much love, Laura. I think I'm gonna post again tonight. Uh, I have one that I'm really excited to post. I think I think it'll good. I think it'll do good, but I don't know. But we're gonna put it out there tonight. I hope you. Ooh, did 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 Argentina just win? I think Argentina just won. Wait. Oh, it's, it's still tied. Okay, we got this. I don't know why Argentina. I just think Argentina's going to win. I got a feeling. Hey, Kristen. Good to see you. I'll be back waking the pup. Waking the pup. Ooh, thanks for the follow. We start us off with some, uh, some Pictionary. Just one. So addicted. <laughs> I'm so addicted to this game. Okay, here we go. Just one. Just one, guys. This is kind of hard, but at the same time, we got this. Not a pickle. This is kind of hard, but I think we got this, guys. Come on. Someone got it. Someone got it. Four people got it. 
Five people got it. The green means. What does green mean? Green means. Hi, Dell. All right, who was first? First was Maureen. Good job, Maureen. You are a winner. You are a winner. Green means light. Green means go. Maureen dropping gold mine. Thank you, Maureen. You're a winner. You're a winner. Green equals stop. Not, not in Canada. In Canada, green means go. Go faster. Faster? That's a Tennessee thing. That's a brandy thing. Another, please. Oh my goodness. We get hooked. We get so hooked. We love it. Your stoplights are opposite. We have red on top. No, I couldn't even figure out which one's on top. I forgot. Um, but yeah, I think I just mixed it up. <laughs> I was thinking, I was like, which one's on top? No, red's definitely on top. Ask Chantel about her huge Pictionary win this AM. Chantel always wins Pictionary. Like always. And Maria. Hi, Maria. Hi, Ruthie. I share La Framboise. Yeah, we're all champs. We're all champs here. We're all Pictionary champs. I think we've all got to that level now. I just see, uh... My daughter. Red's on top, green's below. Red means stop, green means go. Yellow means wait, even if you're late. Ooh. I like that. I thought yellow means take caution. <laughs> yellow is like just just make a decision quick. Quick quick. Hi Ethan. Drinking. Dolly's drinking. I should be drinking too. Love your new post. Thank you, Adele. Yellow means speed up. No, 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 no. We gotta take action on the road. We gotta, we gotta make sure we're following the rules. Hi, Ida. Good morning. Hi, user 99. Not drinking. Oh, I see. Okay, okay. Yes. Not drinking and driving. That too. But drink your water. It's important. Hi, Mafia Head. This song reminds me of the summer. Columbia vibes. I think Wendy posted an edit of a flashback in Colombia and uh, brought back memories of the summer, you know, summer vibes. Where are we going next? I was doing so much research last night. Um, the place I want to go to, I don't know if it's possible, but I don't want to give it away. But yeah, we're still doing research. Vamos a bailar. Hello, Alicia. Yeah, so we're doing a lot of research, trying to figure out where and when. We got New Year's coming up. That's exciting. Starts with a J. Starts with a J. J. What country starts with a J? I don't think it's a J. I mean, it might be a J. Hi, Claire. Amory's tapping. Thanks, Amory. Oh, Japan, Jamaica, 
Maybe. Maybe. Philippines. Oh, I looked yesterday because there's a, there's like um under creator tools you can see like what country follows you the most and then what city uh, follows you the most and the number one city for me i want to see if anyone can guess it i don't think anyone guess it but anyways the number one city for me bangkok i smile at jamaica Cat says hi, she's getting her hair cut, let's go. I'm gonna get mine soon. I'm gonna get mine before I uh, go away. Clean up the bit, sides. But we gotta figure out where we're going first. Manila, my city showed up as my hometown. I was like, that's not accurate. No way. <laughs> uh, yeah, I don't think anyone follows me in Canada. I mean, I think like 10% of my followers are from Canada. Um, most are from Philippines. 38% from Philippines. I think 34% is the States. And then like 12% is UK, 10% is Canada. And yeah. Hi from Thailand. I'm gonna guess that T Rux from Bangkok because that's the number one city right now for the followers. We got the 69 crew, exactly 69. As soon as I looked up, 69. Why is that? No se, no se. I wanna go to Paris. That'd be cool. That'd be really cool. Should we go to Paris? Is it hot there now? I don't think it's hot there right now. Do the translation despacito. Pasito a pasito, nos vamos pegando poquito a poquito hasta provocar tus gritos. Y que olvides tu. I don't know as much Spanish as I thought. Let's go. Let's go. I'm so excited to announce you guys, but like I have to have it booked first and it's not yet. So I can't say anything. And I don't know, like, I don't know exactly what I'm doing yet because I don't think it's possible to do what I wanted to do, if that makes sense. So we're just waiting. Isn't that song a little naughty? I have no idea. Is it? Should we put on the clean version of Despacito? Despacito. BRB. Where's she going? What kind of clothes will you pack? That'll give it away. That'll give it away. Um, I like to pack light. I like to pack really late. We're not gonna bring much. Montreal is always a good time. Montreal is fun. Can you speak Thai? I know Kapu and Kap. That means I think thank you. Kapu and Kap. What are you wearing for the photo shoot? I don't know. Uh, I have an idea, but that's that's tomorrow night's process. We're gonna have to decide. Probably the white dress shirt. Probably a white shirt and blue jeans. Some different looks. Yeah, I'm just updating it because my hair is long now. So, you know, different picks. Different picks. And now, if you look at my search history right now, you'd be able to know exactly where we're going because we've just been doing so much research. Last night, I think I spent like three, four hours deciding where, how, when, but we didn't really get to a conclusion. You're looking for a serious relationship. Nice. You know what you want. That's good. That's good. Mexico. Jamaica. You're from Madagascar. Africa would be really cool. Is it a long or a short word? I'm not saying. I'm not saying. Kenya. Maybe I'm going to Nairobi. Michelle's from Illinois. The Maldives. 
If you could go anywhere right now, but if you go anywhere right now, but you wanted to go somewhere that was hot, where would you go? But like somewhere that was nice weather right now. Where would you go? You're in Nairobi. Should we come? Should we go to Nairobi? Hey Chantel, you go to Greece. Is Greece really nice right now? I don't know if Greece is super nice right now. Philippines. I think it's rainy season. I think it's rainy season in um, Hawaii. Hawaii is insane. Bermuda. Wow. I think it's hard to decide because there's too many good places, you know? Bongo, what do you say? Where should we go? Okay. <laughs> cool. Cool. Bora Bora. Should we go to Bora Bora? Holy. That'd be crazy. Didn't realize there were so many Kenyans in this live. Yeah. The last, I think the last video that went viral was viral in Kenya. Australia. Bali. Fiji. Fiji. Hey, Sam, man. Good to see you. Welcome, welcome. Bali would be fun. Well, I want to do Bali with Black AT Mom, though. That's a vibe. We just got to figure out a good time. Chantel's got a huge bucket list. Kenyans never disappoint. Let's freaking go. Where are you from? I'm from Canada. I'm from Toronto. Have I ever been to the Philippines? I've never been in the Philippines. Bali's a vibe. That was weird. We just got requested to a four-way live, but it was only like for like a second and then they declined it. Weird. Um, yeah, Indonesia. Oh, see, there's too many good places. It's so hard to decide. It's so hard to decide. They keep doing that. They keep inviting me and then declining it. Hey, stop. Who's doing that? We rock um, the beanie the black 18 mom got me. Does it match? No, it doesn't match. This matches. We need more colors. Yeah. Ooh, I like this one. I haven't worn this one in a while. Or this one. Beanie season, guys. It's beanie season. Samantha's done work. Oh, it's Friday. She's pumped. She's going to go out and party tonight. It's partying time. Hope you come back to Thailand. Yeah, I've been to Thailand. I did most of the places in Thailand, but um, I didn't do... There's two places in Thailand. I really want to go Krabi. Krabi. And it was this island for scuba diving that looks really cool. And I didn't end up having time to go there either. Chantel's at the car wash. Nice. Nice, nice. making dinner already what's for dinner i just bought the best toast ever like i'm so addicted to this toast it's so good i woke up this morning and felt really gross really sick but anyways then i felt really good i was just like whoa and i was craving this and we just devoured it have you guys ever had this before it's cinnabon bread and it literally tastes like a cinnamon cinnamon bun. And I put like, I put like um, peanut butter, which is so good. And I made it really hot. And, and then I added um, 
This is so not like we shouldn't be doing this for breakfast every morning. But then I added, uh, then I added this stuff. Oh my goodness, it was so good. And like the peanut butter, peanut butter was like dripping off. And like, so was the, like, it was, uh, it's so good. Not healthy, but like so good. Sugar rush. Yeah. <laughs> it was a sugary morning. It was a sugary morning. I even mean, bought juice boxes because I don't know. I was walking by the, I was, I went shopping yesterday and I walked by the aisle and I just saw these Allen fruit punch juice boxes and it just reminded me of my childhood. So I just wanted to relive it for a bit and drink out of a juice box. So we bought like a little pack of juice boxes. <laughs> um, yeah, see, we just loaded up. You know my, okay. I want to see if you guys can guess. My favorite ever fruit for the longest time was mango. Love mango was addicted to mango, ate so much mango that I can't even eat mango anymore. And it's no longer my favorite fruit. But there's a fruit that like, I didn't eat very much as a kid. I like kind of ate it like in my teens, but not too much. I never really like loved it, loved it. Now I'm obsessed with this fruit. What fruit is it? I wanna see if people can guess. Like I just have a greater appreciation for this fruit now that I'm like, you know, 30 and Not blueberries. Oh, someone said it. Pineapples. Pineapples. Yes, pineapples. They're so freaking good. I think pineapples are my favorite fruit now. They're so... I could just eat like a whole... Okay. And then my second favorite fruit now is... It's not mango. What's my second favorite fruit? I don't think anyone's going to get this. My second favorite fruit. I haven't even seen it yet in the chat. What's my second favorite? Not watermelon. Uh, not dragon fruit. I don't think anyone's gonna get it. Orange, kiwi, nope. Nope. Not kiwi. It's not kiwi. Not peaches. Not pineapple's number one for me. Not strawberry, not orange. I don't think anyone's gonna get it. Pears, not pears. I have it right now in the fridge. And I actually had so much of it last night. It's not star fruit. Bananas, nope. Passion fruit, no, no one's got it. Karen got it. Victory Rose. My second favorite fruit right now is uh, pomegranate. So obsessed. Like I, this is a lot. And I finished this whole thing last night. Like it's just so good. Oh, yeah. Love pomegranate. But the seeds, I like the seeds. I like it. But yeah, it's good antioxidants. Kristen knows. Caution, tons of sugar. I know. Yeah, it doesn't help what we had for breakfast this morning. But you know, it's an off day from the gym. It's cheat day. We're not even going to the gym. Um, tomorrow gym though. What's the fruit? My favorite fruit. Is pineapple. My second favorite fruit is pomegranate. I don't like strawberries that much. I don't know. Oh, I remember why I stopped eating strawberries. I saw something. It was a video, and it was like someone like looking on um in on strawberries with like one of those like microscopes, and I saw all these like little like crawly bacteria things, and I just can't look at strawberries the same way anymore. I'm sure like a lot of fruits have that, but like. Yeah, I watched it. I just can't eat strawberries anymore. I just, I just, I just, just can't. It's just not the same anymore. Yeah, it's on anything, I know. But like, I didn't really like seeing it. Blueberries are good too. Hi, Teresa. Do I like going to the gym? Some days I don't. I like walking out of the gym. It's a good feeling. If only we can get that feeling without having to go. Just the feeling of walking out when you're like, we did it. We did it. I ruined strawberries for you. No. That's not good. Work out at home. I'm going to take this day off. I'm going to post tonight. 
I'm going to catch up on notifications. I'm going to relax. I might even do some research to figure out more of where I'm going. Um, yeah, it's a relaxing Friday. No family dinner tonight. Oot. I never said oot. Ugh. Tomorrow's picks day. No, Sunday. Tomorrow's a uh, fam day. Day with the fam. When you traveling? So I don't know exactly when I'm traveling, but I do know that I want to leave soon ish. Um, but I'm just trying to figure out logistics before just booking a bunch of stuff. We make us wait for the picks. I don't even know how it works. The last time they, um, they like give it to you on these like cards, but I'm thinking it'll be the same kind of thing, but I'll definitely share. take outfits with the uh three different like styles i think casual dressy and trendy are you gonna be offline on your vacations no if anything you know we're gonna be doing it up very similarly the last time so you're coming on these travels with me we're not being offline um maybe like instead of those like long six seven hour lives while we're away we'll just do like a bunch of short ones but no you'll definitely be joining on this next trip. Do you have them picked out? We hope. Uh, they have like, they have like guidelines on certain things you can bring, like no logos and stuff. So I'm gonna have to kind of pick it out tomorrow. Same deal as last time. Yeah, I'm excited too. I get really excited once I start booking, but right now it's like that part where I'm just like, we haven't really done much, we're just looking, looking, but nothing official yet. Hi, Laura. The red shirt. Yeah. Should we? I feel like the white shirt is, like, the classiest. I can... Connie's looking forward to traveling. Let's go. Yeah, those travel memories, I swear. I, like, I look back on a lot of things and uh, that was definitely amazing. Like, just arriving in Colombia, I was so lost. I was so just, like, not sure of what I was going to do on this trip. I wasn't even sure if I was, like, happy. And then the trip just kind of just worked itself out where I got more comfortable in Colombia. And then, yeah, it just was awesome. It was nice. It was really fun. I'm glad I took that, like, leap because I feel like I was kind of hesitant on it at first. I was like, Columbia, do you like driving trips? Um, if I'm not driving, yes. Hi, Gia. How are you doing? Happy Friday. And you made a friend there. Yeah, we did. I was thinking... Um, for this round, for this time that we travel, I might stay in a hostel, um, at least for some of the, some of the places, because it's just nice that way, you don't have to, like, you know, everyone is, like, traveling, and you can meet a bunch of people, uh, like, this summer was nice, but we were in Airbnbs, it was so hard to meet people that, like, on the times where I wanted to be social, there weren't a lot of people that were just, like, you know, oot and a boot, um, so maybe I'll stay in hostels for a bit, just to experience something else. We'll see. We'll see. Hi, Jenny. I hope. Oot. Hi, Lynn. Yeah, and the one hostel we tried to was freezing. And I got so many good reviews that place. But yeah, I definitely have the coldest room in the whole, whole place. 
It was freezing. I remember I got out of the shower my first day there. This was where... Is this Peru, right? Peru. Got to the got to the hostel in Peru. Showered. I came out of the shower. It was like a hot shower. I was freezing. <laughs> like, I was so cold. I was like, I don't know if I can do this. I remember, like, I put my phone down. I was about to do a live. And I was, like, shivering. I was like, nah. Nah. Not a good idea. Oh, look, it's William Wade. I don't even know, like, what that means. How's it going, princess? <laughs> now. <sighs> oh, I'm so comfy right now. You guys. I love bed. Maureen, thank you for the hand hearts. Can you say hi to me, please? Hi, Lenny. Hi, Lenny. Mods on top. I think they got confused. How's the temperature over there? It is cold. I'll tell you exactly what the weather is right now. The weather right now in Richmond Hill, it's minus one. So it's below freezing. And uh, the temperature in Fahrenheit is 30. It's 30 right now. 30, and that's not Celsius, that's Fahrenheit. That's cold, cold. I'm here from the Philippines, watching from Qatar. Cool. That's not bad, really. It's going to be minus six tonight. Holy. Yeah, it's cold. There's no snow, though. There's no snow. Um, we haven't had too much snow so far. Like, we had a couple snowfalls, but there hasn't been too much snow. Your phone's at 69%. Sure, mine is, too. Just kind of works out that way. We also have 69 people in the chat, so, you know. We, we always have to point it out. Like, you know. Let's try and like not one day. Let's see what happens. Um, <laughs> hi, Annie. Yeah, no snow. No snow. Someone said you look snuggly today. Yeah, we've been really, really lazy today. Um, <laughs> we're going to the gym tomorrow though. Yesterday was so productive. Yesterday I did a lot. Yesterday I was on top of things. Today, just comfy vibes. We're just chilling. We're just coasting. Hi, Esther. Good morning from Thailand. Hi, Jackie. This is a good song. It's been a long week, eh? Marine's ready to just uh, kick back and either watch a bunch of movies or she's gonna hit up the clubs tonight and just go all out. She's just not sure which which end she's gonna go to. Is it gonna be this extreme or this extreme? This is the Vinci blanket. It's so soft. I love this blanket. Do you guys know who sings the song? This is the club is my couch. Club is my bed. It's a party in my bed. Who wants to come? <laughs> Joking. We gotta get out. We gotta get out. We're gonna go maybe go for a walk too. Something today. Christmas shopping. Ooh. What's your mental health right now? Mm, seven? Seven today? It was a four or five this morning so I just woke up and felt really really gross really sick but we're better now hi Liz it's radio had you right thank you Lenny this is a radio head not creed this is radio head this is called creep cuddle time 
what do you say bongo is it that kind of vibe you made an edit with a song this is a chill song i like it i don't listen to a lot of radiohead but it was recommended Oh, when you say gross, is that physical gross or mental health gross? No, physical. This morning I woke up and I just felt like really, um, like nauseous. Physical. This song's good, eh? I love it. Poop stank. Pooba stank. Love your skin tone. Thank you. You're six today. Well, the day's like halfway over, so you can change it. Be an eight. Are you still drinking your tea at night? No. No. No tea. I haven't had anything hot to drink in a while. No tea, no coffee. Actually, no, we had a coffee at Cora's a couple days ago. But yeah, I haven't had a tea in forever. Amalita, thank you for the follow. Carrie, hello. Sandy's a nine. Damn. Sandy's thriving right now. We gotta get some of Sandy's energy, you know? Did you eat late last night? No, I actually didn't. I mean, I ate late, but I thought that eating late with the stuff I ate would be okay. I had all these like fruits. I like mucked. I had like blueberries and pomegranate and pineapple. And then I went to bed. But we learned very quickly this morning that fruit isn't a good idea either. No, no, no. A lot of sevens, a lot of sevens in the chat. Guys, I just got I just got a request from someone and their name was Wolverine Cosplay. At least we ate healthy foods last night. Yeah, exactly. I figured, you know, if we do it healthy. You know, maybe we'll, it won't be the same effect, but no, just no food. No food, no food at 3 a.m., okay? How hard is that to understand, Blackie? You can't eat a lot before bed, okay? So, cheese. We learn quickly. Pineapple's very acidic. Ooh, maybe that's why. Maybe that's why. And the pomegranate too. The seeds. If I eat late, I have crazy dreams. I never have crazy dreams. We're not doing it right. Holy. Hi, Diane Blackman. No movies, no movies. I've been watching a lot of YouTube, a lot of YouTube. Um, I just got hooked. YouTube and FYP on TikTok. Like I love those two. Good morning, Alma. Wakey, wakey. Teresa, feel better. Hi, Sylvia. or a short one is this a chill one or a not chill one predictions put out there long or short chill or unchill which way are we going what makes you say that 
It's a chill long live. Okay, a chill long one. You never know. It's true, you, you really do never know. Last saying hello. Hi, Anastasia. Jan Eagle, thanks for tapping. Thank you, Diane. Thank you, thank you. What song is this? Isn't it good? This is called 25 Minutes. 25 Minutes by Michael Learns the Rock. It's a good tune. Good tune. First crystal, my dad's name, Sean. We send you our love. Send you our love, so, uh, Lucia. I'm sorry. John Eagle, thank you. No battle. I don't remember the last time we did one. Does anyone know? What month was that? I think it had to have been October. I don't think we did one in November. Long time ago. Long time ago. Sing for me. 300k, 300k. Sean tells us to remember. It was a long time ago. It wasn't Spencer Pratt, no. Maybe it was shreds or something. You're eating your fingers. <laughs> My fingers. Ooh, this is a really good song. I forgot about the song. Michael Learns the Rock has some good stuff. Did you... Do you participate in Battle Week? Wasn't there only one? I, I don't know of any other. Did I miss out on another one? No. Um, Battle Week is Live Week, right? Same thing. Same thing. But no, I don't think there's another one. Much like the song. Wanna start a new life, but it seems to be rather absurd. There's one last year, there's another one this year, no way. That's cool. I didn't know there's another one. I thought it was like a one-time thing. So let's go. That's cool. Enrique Iglesias. No, this is still Michael Learns to Rock. We're on a Michael Learns to Rock vibe. Drive safe his ass. We weren't around for last year's. Last year's was, was that February? No, that was during the 24 hour live. That was January. Was that end of January? Wow. That was this year. That's crazy. Feels like last year yeah this is someday what time is it there now it is five to five it's five to five 4 55 it's like almost dinner time it's almost time to muck but not yet don't get too excited we got a lot of people in the live right now from from Africa, I'm not gonna lie, let's go. Let's go Africa. Did you see the Leeds game? Leeds are on fire. Sorry, Reed, I haven't been listening to you, been in the chat. Which chat? This chat? Hi, Terry. Hi, Hannah. Thank you, Tammy. Happy Friday. Okay. 
Enrique. Hi Diana, hi Sylvia. Hi okay, Kyle. Bobby's back. Do you like the song? Bailamos. I learned a Brazilian dance yet. No, no. I won't ever be able to learn that. It's too complex for me. It's too many moves. We just watch that. We just enjoy. We're jamming. It's officially weekend, guys. It's officially the weekend. I saw a TikTok the other day. This guy broke down the steps to do it. No way. I've seen those, and I can't even follow those. We can't do those moves. Like, that's just out of our, like... No. It's too difficult. From which country? Soy de Canada. Canada. Te quiero. Te quiero también. I bet you could. I cannot. I cannot. There was a dance that I had tried to do when it was like trending many, many months ago. And I, I just gave up. And it was simple. It was simple. I just can't follow moves. I kind of just do my own thing. <laughs> Whatever it is. Um, No, I cannot. I cannot. Good to see you, Jesse. Long time. Long time. I love seeing that people that I thought disappear come back and they're like, still here. Still here, you know? Hi, Susan. Hi, Rachel Jones. What color are your eyes? I think my eyes are green. Greenish gray. Depends what I'm wearing. Jessie's still here. She's working in promotion. It's a crazy time of the year, but she's still here. Karen's still here. She's jamming. You should play Ricky, Mar Ricky Martin. We're just in the Spanish mood. Stuck with dark brown eyes. Are you kidding me? I would love to have brown eyes. I like dark eyes. Want to trade? You can't. You can't ask for a back though. Once I get your brown eyes, you can't. You can't do any trades. Okay, it's finalized. Okay, no take backs. I'd, I'd, I've always wanted to have dark eyes. I kind of like the dark eyes. My black 18 mom has dark eyes. Uh, black 18 sis has dark eyes. But the boys in the family don't. We got that, that hazel greenish gray. Okay, I'm gonna switch to Jillian. You're lucky though, these eyes have laser eye surgery. So if you wear glasses, you don't need to anymore. You just, once you pop my eyes in, you're 2020. You're 2020. Actually, I'm only switching with 2020s. <laughs> it's the only way we'll trade. You have to have 2020 vision, okay? And and dark eyes. Dark eyes, and then we can trade. Okay, cool. I'm glad we figured that out. I feel like I'm like... I feel like I'm on an all-inclusive right now. Like on the beach, like they're playing activities by the pool, you know, they're doing like a competition, like a push up competition, like drinking pina colada, 
sand in between my toes. It's like crunching and stuff. Um, <laughs> getting burnt. I love this vibe. Oh my goodness, it's raining gold mine. And it's raining gold mine. Like, what else is new? You know, that's my kind of vacation. Let's go, Maureen. You know, once it starts pouring rain, pouring gold. Jillian, thank you for the finger hearts. Okay, bye. <laughs> bye, Maureen. Are you manifesting? Is this a hint? Is he giving me a hint? Did he just say all-inclusive, guys? Is this mean he's going to an all-inclusive? Everything's a hint these days. Everything I say is a hint now. It's just we can't even get around like the fact that it's, nothing's a hint anymore. We don't even know where we're going. We're still hinting everything. Maybe we're going Dominican. Dim that was weird. That was weird. Anne Marie and I like literally like. Anne Marie, what am I thinking of right now? That was weird. She's like in my brain. Jinx. <laughs> um, okay. Ricky, it's enough. Okay? Shh. Someone's name is Eye of the Tiger. Hi, Renee. Ella, thanks for the follow. See? You notice it says pretty brown eyes. This is Desmond. Sean Desmond. Hi, Leah from Kuwait. What are you thinking? I can't tell you what I'm thinking right now. It's a secret. I don't even know if mine are hazel. When people ask me, I still don't know what to say. I think my license, I think my um, driver's license says green, but it's not green. They're not green. Still thinking about Wolverine cosplay. I want to see if he's still available. Oh my goodness, he is. Should we do it? I have to at this point. This might be our first decline of the day. Does Wolverine want to cosplay with us right now? No! No! He's not down. He's not down. Yeah, it's a secret. Can't tell you what I'm thinking. Die with the travel. Die with the travel. Let's go. Santorini. Okay, so we have, how about this? We, we get the next three travels, we have to pick one of them. That's where we go to. But wait, we really did Santorini. This is no fun. This is no fun. Hi, Amanda. Thank you, Dottie. Thank you, Sandy. Die with the second travel. The second choice. Is that Arizona? Is that Arizona? Is it a little bit Tyler? Thank you, Dottie. Thank you, thank you. But yeah, I don't know what I'm leaving. Can we do picture to guess where you're going? <laughs> I don't even know what that means. Okay. Yeah, we're gonna play Pictionary, guys. This is where I'm going. You ready? That's all I got. That's all I got. If you can't get it from this, then I, I can't do any better. Ten people got it. Hi, Kelly from Australia. 
smoke. Shit. Yeah, but what am I pointing to? Only 12 people got it. Holy, I gotta draw better chimneys. I gotta draw better chimneys, guys. But who is first? Chantel. What the heck? I, I think literally she hacks the system, guys. Chantel's like up in her attic, just like typing all these like symbols and like, you know, what's going on? Like something's up, guys. Is Chantel like a robot? She's like an AI bot. <laughs> what the heck? Someone stop this girl. She's going nuts. She sees it first because she's close to you. Oh, yeah. That's why. She's in Ontario, so she sees everything quick. He gets that, like, it's that, like, it's that Ontario, like, Wi-Fi. Like, we're all connected, you know? Everyone else gets it later. There we go. That's why. We figured it out. Jillian, let's go. Jane, let's go. Let's freaking go. We're getting roses. Let's go, baby. Chantel's a Pictionary champ today. Guys, we've only done two rounds, okay? There's no champ yet. There's no champ yet. Have you done the AI trend? No, I was hoping to see an edit because I don't know how to do it. So I was waiting for like a banger edit with the AI trends, but I never saw one. But I don't know how people do it. They're so cool. Like, is it an app? How do you do it? I want to do AI. I want an AI trend. She crushed Will Pictionary. No way. She's just, she's just been crushing Pictionary lives. What, she like jumps into Pictionary lives and just, holy, damn. AI would be fun. I don't know, I want to know what I look like, AI. AI. I like this song too, this is a good song. I don't know. I thought it was maybe an app. I don't think it's a filter. I think it's an app. Like, whoever's done the AI stuff, I don't know how. What's the secret? I got a lot of practice with me. There we go. Love you, bye, Emily. What part of Ontario? I'm from north of Toronto. North of Toronto. I'm on the south part of Ontario. South east. Southeast. Hi, Leanne. Good morning from Philippines, Lynn. Guys, where should we do New Year's? Where should we go? Brighton. Brighton sounds like British. From Brighton. Is Brighton, Ontario? No way. There's no way Ontario has a Brighton. Brighton, Ontario. No way. That does not exist. Holy, it does. It's a town in Ontario, Brighton. Where is this? Oh, it's on the way to Ottawa. Cool. New Zealand. Ontario has a London, Paris. I know. I went to school in London. I didn't know we had a Paris, though. That's kind of cool. I live in Fort Vermilion, Alberta. I've never heard of that. Well, I've heard of Alberta, but I don't know Fort Vermilion. Well, that's cool. Alberta's a vibe. You got BC beside you. That's kind of cool. Should we just go to, like... <laughs> Should we just go to, like, Nunavut? Guys, let's just go to Nunavut, and then we'll go to Northwest Territories, and then we'll finish with the Yukon, and then come home. Just do, like, the randomest places in Canada ever. Just hit up Yukon, like, just hit up Whitehorse, and, um, you know, maybe even go up to Greensland. Where is this? Yeah, just go up to Greensland, and, uh, Greensland. Uh, 
in the Baffin Bay. <sighs> yeah, I think it's cold there. Yeah, no, it's cold there. Leanne, thank you for the whale. Thank you. Thanks, Leanne. 